welcome this is the energy vibration um, reading for the Ophias Sun Moon and Rising sign we're at the Ophias this is the third portal let's look and check out and see what is coming in for you guys um, this is the energy for April May and June whatever is transpiring and whatever is happening let's check out to see what is transpiring so for you guys um, I want to help you to remember please like share this video thumbs up um, leave a message this is the third quarter okay love reading is already up and the judgment information is coming out whatever secrets there was it's going to be coming out um, so expect that in April okay so whenever the energy of judgment is breakthrough information is coming out the energy of the stars here this is good together because this is if your universal angels and guides wanted this information to come out whatever that was working against you or with you or against you um, you know there is hope that is coming in and it's going to be coming in in May in June success success there is a lot of success so much success that is coming at you guys so this is just going to be powerful for you guys oh my god this is the first time the sun comes out in the squatel and you ophiosis people i told you you are just like one of the luckiest people on this planet this is the first time the sun comes out and it's for you guys now whatever the information that is going to be coming out <laughs> whatever the information that is going to be coming out this information is definitely going to be good and helping you guys okay so some lies and deception and some information is going to be coming out and it's going to be helping you guys um, let's see what else is happening the truth is going to be coming out about a situation and the lies and deception truth is going to be coming out about a situation there's transition that is coming in so hope and faith is here the transition is that you're going to be very successful okay I said you are going to be extremely extremely successful okay something that within our organization is finally coming to an end some deceitfulness some lies deception deceitfulness in an organization is finally 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 coming to an end now what is happening is that some information is about to come in and the truth is going to be coming out and you are going to be very very victorious now the center of your reading has to do with transition and the energy of the hope star and hope that is happening and this is ending up that you're going to be very successful so a lot of you were dealing with some in uh, unsavory things and the energy of the tower it has to do with an organization a group of people that was unsavory and this is coming down damn this is so good please connect with us and please like share this video and subscribe subscribe find people who are born november 24th until december um 17th these people are you guys are one of the most blessed and protective person on this planet whatever the information is or was um that is coming out the truth about a situation is going to come out and transition of that and is going to be happening and this is the time for this information to come out so please connect with me on on demand because on the on demand you will receive more information what is going to be transpiring and happening in this scenario I'm loving your reading because obviously some of you and there is twice the um, twice this coming up victory and success there is a situation with a business and an organization um, for some of you in business for some of you it's going to be full out you are going to be hitting the marks you're going to be going you're going to be making it okay it's about time that the blockage some of you were blocked and now 
this block is lifting up you are going to be making it you're gonna be hitting the mark you're gonna be moving forward and you're going to be making it okay victory and success is coming out number seven use the number seven energy um, in this um, quarter because you're coming out on top okay another successful energy is the energy of the Sun if you decide to travel in this quarter is going to be good whatever you decide whatever movement house movement finding a new place it is going to be happening for you and it's going to be very victorious and successful now whatever the situation is and the energy that um, that was blocking you this is going to be lifted up because um, it's as if the universe is going to be coming in and these situations are going to be lifting up and it's going to be um very 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 positive okay so remember to go check out other people's reading because then you can find out what is coming up for your partners your friends and that sort of a thing and they're going to be helping you out I'm working with the angels and saint and I was guided of because it's the quarter reading because they will um, you know they're going to be showing you stuff so working with angels and saints is very positive because what they do is basically bring out what it is that you need to work on marriage so here again the energy of marriage comes in um, this is um, the, the, the merging your left and right brain um, it is about merging your mighty I am present self it is about the marriage between you and yourself the marriage between you and your partner the marriage between you and your um, business your work and that sort of a thing so marriage comes up in different ways and meaning and we're going to be looking at your marriage what else is coming out this is beautiful because the marriage has not come out for any other sign San Francis keep on coming up and whatever is happening in this third quarter is as if San Francis is teaching you about animals and your animal spirit guides and yet still the animals that is around you okay so remember San Francis is coming out and the fire sign people San Francis have been coming out for you fire sign people another beautiful energy um, you are the leader and this is what I've been explaining to a lot of you Sagittarians is that you are the leaders you are the healers you can give life and take life this is how powerful you guys are you are Sagittarians and you're of Saliti um, you are the 13th sign that nobody wanted you to know who you are and now you're coming out and you need to understand that you can listen to the Sagittarians reading also but you need to listen to your own energy vibration reading because this if you notice the energies that is coming out they want you to work with animals St. Francis of the Sissy is here Joan of the Hark is here these are and the marriage is here these are powerful energies that is coming out to align you to remind you of who you are and these are so beautiful because St. Catherine of Alexander is also here so if you look at these beautiful energies and you check out the other readings for the third quarter you will realize that you guys have really really received some beautiful energies and whatever is happening with the energy of the animals um um, whatever is happening with the energy of the animal st. Francis is here and for, for most of the fire signs um, st. Francis came out um, for them Francis from the sissy came out because he wants to teach you something about animals and it is time for you guys to call upon your animal spirit guides okay Elin is also here and it is beautiful call upon st. Padre Call upon St. Padre for healing. And as you call upon St. Padre for healing, you're going to be a sign, see a sign coming from um, a sign from above. So if you are going through a situation, call upon divine intervention. Um, call upon St. Padre for healing. And he is going to show you that this healing is going to be done. Okay, so that's a message for someone out there. So if you're going to... Um, if you're sick if you're going through sickness and that sort of a thing and uh, Elin is going to be taking place call upon Elin for other people send Elin to other people this is good you can call upon San Padre and Archangel Raphael um, they will come in and definitely bring forward Elin for others okay 
Now, for the energy of marriage for the Ophiosis people for the third quarter, let's see what is going to be happening. There's a lot of messages that is going to be coming in. There's a lot of people who wants to connect with you. There's a lot of people, a lot of suitors who are out there um, in business and also in marriage. A lot of suitors and a lot of business people that is out there. And this is going to be good. A lot of information is going to be coming in and a lot of people want to let you know you know how they feel about you and they want to connect with you so let's say that st francis from the sissy what do you have for the obvious people is there he is going to be opening doors of opportunities and moving away whatever that was blocking you so call upon the fire salamander and the fire dragon so cleanse the energy in your house around you and in you because what is going to be transpiring is that um, by these energies and these situation being cleansed you are going to be finding out that these um, the changes are going to be happening for you guys so be a leader and this is good be a leader for your family this is a six of cups so someone um, out there needs to be a leader for your family take up the leader you are the leader st. Joan of Arc is going to be helping you um, to use this leading position in your life to help others in, on their own journey so this is a really wonderful really beautiful and really alignment worries came up but release yourself from the worries whatever the worries is just release yourself from the worries whatever that is transpiring um, release yourself from whatever worries that is coming in now seek good okay so some of you um, have worries and they're saying seek the good out of this situation so learn the lessons you know see what are you learning from the situation just see what are you learning from the situation because obviously some of you are going to be learning something from a situation that is transpiring in your life so it is a beautiful readings I want to see if I can really take the camera down to let you guys see this is really a beautiful reading I'm gonna shift the camera just look at how beautiful your reading is ladies and gentlemen so um, I haven't done this for the other viewers so I hope they don't get jealous um, that you guys get to see the cards but it's just uh, so beautiful I have to show you guys okay so um, please like share these videos whatever is happening whatever is transpiring you're definitely going to be moving forward you're definitely going to be out of the situation you're definitely going to be understanding what is transpiring around you um, new things are about to happen for you guys so this is going to be good um, remember to like share likes and share these videos because as you like and share these videos you're going to be realizing that things and situation is going to be falling in place for you so ladies and gentlemen I want to say thank you so much um, and please like and share these videos namaste until next time